Hi, and welcome to my story with Care Credit. We all have stories, but what makes these stories unique is that they are about people who are able to get life-changing treatment, procedures, or medical care for themselves, their family, and their pets. All of the people featured on My Story with Care Credit did it with their Care Credit credit card. Care Credit is a leading national healthcare credit card that can enable you to get many of the procedures and treatments you want now and pay over time with everyday promotional financing on purchases of $200 or more. Care Credit is accepted at hundreds of thousands of locations nationwide to pay for care whenever you need and want it. I'm your host, Amy Freena, and I'm excited to share this story about a Care Credit card holder who nursed her pet bird back to health a while ago, only to have her experience the exact same symptoms earlier this year. Hi, I'm Priscilla, and this is Duffy, and I've been a Care Credit card holder for one year. Duffy is a cockatiel. She's my best friend and I love taking her out places and she loves getting attention and a lot of love from everyone. One day I noticed that Duffy wasn't eating, she wasn't drinking water and I was really worried about her. And I looked for the best vet possible and I brought her in for treatment and I was really worried about being able to get her treatment. I couldn't imagine having my life without her. And it was very difficult to think that that could have been the last day that I saw her when I brought her to the vet. So while I was in the waiting room, I noticed that there was a brochure for care credit and I didn't really know anything about it, but I picked it up and I found out that you could apply online. So I applied on my phone and I was approved within a couple of minutes. At the time, they weren't able to figure out what was wrong with her, but earlier this year, she ended up having similar symptoms, so I brought her in right away because I had care credit. So I didn't have to worry about being able to pay for her treatment, and care credit really helped me out. And it's just so convenient to be able to not have to worry about being able to get vet care for your pets when you really need it. Thank you, Care Credit, for saving Duffy's life. I couldn't do it without you. Hey, I'm Amy, and we are live in the studio today with Priscilla and Duffy, who are going to tell us a little bit about their Care Credit story. How are you today? Great. Thank oh, you. look at. Hi. Oh, little head rub, huh? Yeah, she right. loves it. Tell me about her. Um, well, I've had Duffy for 10 years. Mm -hmm. I don't know how old she is because she's rescue. We okay. got her from a relative who passed away. Mm -hmm. And. Um, <laughs> She's been my best friend ever since. Oh. She never really cared for other birds, but okay. she's always been very attached to people. Mm -hmm. um, I had her in my room growing okay. up um, because she didn't like the other birds very much. And we just had a very close bond uh -huh. since then. So tell us how you heard about Care Credit. Mm -hmm. um, so about a year ago, Duffy got really sick mm -hmm. and she couldn't walk. Um, when I picked her up, she just would fall over, which mm -hmm. is not normal. Yeah. And I noticed that she wasn't eating, so I brought her into the vet okay. because I was really worried that, you know, something was seriously wrong with her. Of course. And while they took her in to stabilize her, I noticed that they had um, a brochure for care credit. Okay. And I didn't know how I was going to pay for her treatment, mm -hmm. so... When I saw the care credit, I saw that you could apply online mm -hmm. really quickly. So while I was waiting, I applied on my phone and I was approved within a couple of minutes. Wow. So so did that, did you just like all of a sudden have this like relief, like, okay, I'm going to handle this. There's no stress. Yeah. So in terms of relief, I mean, I was still really worried that something would happen to her because they told me that she was very thin. Oh. She lost um, about 20% of mm -hmm. her body weight. Mm. And uh, that was contributing to part of the reason why she couldn't walk anymore. Right. And they had no idea because she was so weak. They mm -hmm. couldn't do too many diagnostic tests on her. Gotcha. Um, so it was kind of a mystery. Mm -hmm. But um, I didn't have to worry about being able to pay for the treatment. Right. I knew that I was going to be able to get the best treatment. That's why I chose that vet office mm -hmm. because 
They have a very good reputation through all the bird rescues that I volunteer for. Oh, great. And I just knew that since they took that and I had enough money to pay for the treatment, mm -hmm. I got everything that they recommended because good. I didn't have to worry about being able to pay it back at that moment. Which is, that's great. Because it's you want to just focus on helping her get better and, yeah, and make sure. Yeah, because, you know, even though... I mean, like, when you're upset, your pets know. Mm -hmm. So I didn't want to be too upset right. and bring her mood down because she was already frightened yeah, because she had never really been anywhere other than my house. Mm -hmm. So it was mm -hmm. a really tough time for the both of us. And now she goes everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> How long was it until uh, she started feeling better? Um, so she was in the hospital about a week, mm -hmm. and they weren't sure if she was going to make it. Mm -hmm. uh, they had to tube feed her, oh my gosh. and they said that she wasn't eating on her own. She wasn't really gaining weight either, mm -hmm. and they actually recommended that they... Um, that we look into euthanasia mm -hmm. and I was really upset and I turned to my fellow bird rescuers and I went online and asked them if they thought that it was weird if I brought her home one more day mm -hmm. just so before we put her to sleep that she could have one last happy moment of and feel comfortable at home. You're such a good mama. So they said, no, that's not weird. We've done it so many times. Just tell your vet and I'm positive they'll be okay with that. Mm -hmm. So when I asked my vet, they said, that's perfectly fine. And they asked me, do you want to bring the medications that she's been on just in case? You never know. Things could change. She mm -hmm. could turn around because you know, she would be at home and be right. in a happy place where she's comfortable. And I said, okay, you know, I'll take the medication. So we had one day and the day after we were supposed to bring her into the, um, to the office and mm -hmm. they were going to do the euthanasia. And as soon as I brought her home and I gave her some food, she ate like she had been starving <laughs> and she Aww. was a completely different bird and it was amazing. I was crying. I was so oh, happy. I can't imagine. I mean, it was touch and go from there. I had to hand feed her mm -hmm. every day for about, I think like two weeks maybe, mm -hmm. um, on top of her eating her on her own. Mm -hmm. Um, and she had to be in a very small cage. Um, I had her in a little travel cage because she couldn't stand up straight, so I had to give her um, some things to lean on because gotcha. she, otherwise she would do like somersaults, kind of. Mm -hmm. um, but the more I fed her, she was able to gain weight. She got a lot of treats to put on some weight. Um, she really turned around, mm -hmm. and we kept her on the medication, and she did really well for a while. But... Um, uh, earlier this year, she had the same symptoms again. Oh, no. But I noticed right away that things were similar to when she first got sick. Mm -hmm. So I was able to bring her in because I had the care credit. Right. And I didn't have to worry about, you know, waiting until the last minute because right. things get expensive again. And when I brought her in, they actually did some x-rays because she had some abdominal swelling. And they noticed that something didn't quite look right where her uterus is. Mm -hmm. And um, she actually had, this time around, she passed um, a deflated egg. Huh. And um, they said, well, we think that she has an egg-laying problem. And they recommended that she get a hysterectomy. And it was scary because I was worried it's a major surgery right and they're removing an organ right and she just went through so much yeah mm -hmm. so it was a little scary but I said you know what let's do it because I didn't have to worry about the money because I had care credit mm -hmm. so I was able to get her the surgery she was in and out within an hour Wow. and the vet said she did really well oh what a relief so um, when they opened her uterus to see what was going on because it was inflamed, there was another egg in there. Oh. And we think that that's, that egg had been in there a year because wow. she never passed the egg. And they said that that was what was causing her to become sick Gosh. because it had 
been stuck in there and scar tissue had been growing over it, the body thought, or her body thought that it was a foreign body and her mm. body basically was attacking it. Goodness. Yeah. You guys have been through a lot. Yeah. But now but she's, she's good now. Yes. Everything is, uh, per well, almost perfect, but <laughs> yeah. She looks so cute. So, okay, so you guys have been obviously through a lot and the Care Credit credit card has given you just this peace of mind that's like, okay, if no matter what comes my way, you know, with the beer, you know, in life, that I have this security. If you could write a review on Care Credit based on all of your experience, what would you say? Well, I definitely, if I could give them more than a 10 out of 10, I definitely would. Um, they have been there when I needed them the most. Mm -hmm. I recommend Care Credit to everyone. Mm -hmm. When people have a bird that they rescued and they say they can't afford treatment, mm -hmm. I always recommend Care Credit because it's just so convenient. Finish this sentence for me. Care Credit makes me feel what? Secure. Secure. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for sharing your story with us. We really appreciate it, and we wish you and Duffy the best. Thank you. Remember, Care Credit is a leading national health care credit card that can enable you to get many of the procedures and treatments you want now and pay over time with everyday promotional financing on purchases of $200 or more. Care Credit is accepted at hundreds of thousands of locations nationwide to pay for care whenever you need and want it. If you are interested in applying for a Care Credit credit card or would like to find a provider in your area who accepts Care Credit, visit us at carecredit.com.